How's it going guys? Welcome back to another Heavy Metal Diecast video and another one of our 172nd Armoured Reviews and today we have ourselves an AAV7A1, so an Assault Amphibious Vehicle. Uh, I would have said Amphibious Assault Vehicle, but they say Assault Amphibious Vehicle is the definition <laughs> and this particular one is from the United States Marine Corps. And it is from Operation Restore Hope in Somalia in 1993. And these were an American-made uh, amphibious armoured personnel carrier that is currently still in use by the US Marines, of course, and many other countries around the world. Uh, they were first put into service in 1972 and have been used in many combat areas. The United States Marines operate over 1,300 of these. They can fit around, I think, 21 personnel inside these and i think are armed with a 50 cal and a 40 millimeter grenade launcher and this of course is by dragon armor and uh, i suppose we should talk a little bit less and open up this box so we can check out this awesome looking a die cast model all right with this out of the box this does come in a fantastic uh, acrylic case as well with a nice clear case around it to keep that dust off it we will get that off though because it does keep our eyes off it so uh, we will check this awesome looking uh model out this does look fantastic and it is uh all all nice die cast i think that little turret might be the sort of a plastic bit but it's a nice solid die cast it does have reasonable sort of weight to it but boy the details on this look absolutely insane as i said this is by dragon armor and these always do uh present quite well dragon armor ones are very nice and it's got some lovely shading great level of detail some beautiful unit markings there got some great stowage item details there that looks awesome look at the weathering on the wheels there the tracks are they can i they are pliable ones similar i suppose as i say to your model uh tank ones that you can get like your plastic kit ones boy this detail check out that that looks fantastic <laughs> wow Check out the vent details and that little turret there with the 50 cal and that 40 millimeter grenade launcher does look absolutely awesome. I'm assuming, check the little smoke launchers there. As you can see the size of my hands, this it's quite small, but the level of detail on this, wow, this is just ballistic. That is great. So you can move that around if you are like to do that. But these, these look tough, these things. How they float, I don't know. <laughs> so that is amazing. This does look like a big old chunk of metal that uh, they do throw into the water. They are very effective at what they do. Uh, amphibious assault vehicles, these are fantastic little uh, personnel carriers and very unique. And I reckon they look absolutely awesome. This is another great offering from uh, Dragon Armor, of course. And I am pretty happy about grabbing this one. Hopefully the details do come through in the camera. This is a great looking model and the details are just fantastic. Yep, awesome. All right, I'll, I'll try and keep this uh, short and sweet. I'll wind this video up as per usual. And of course, if you enjoy this, throw us one of those somewhere there. And don't forget to uh, subscribe to the channel if you've yet to do so. You would have seen those pictures at the start of this beast. And uh, Check out where you'll get to see this on the turntable without my sausage fingers all over it, of course. And once again, thank you very much for spending your valuable time in checking out another one of our armor videos. So once again, this is by Dragon Armor. It is the AAV-7A1, which is the amphibious armored personnel carrier from the United States Marine Corps. And I reckon this does look absolutely awesome in 172nd scale die cast. All right, guys, thanks again for spending your time watching another one of our videos. I really do appreciate it. You all have a fantastic rest of your day. Cheers, everyone.